The calla lily is one of my favorite spring and early summer blooming perennials. This is a great plant for Louisiana landscapes. Indeed, it has a long tradition of being used in southern gardens. Now, the calla lily has exquisitely beautiful flowers. These white flowers appear in the spring, usually around about February or March, and linger on into April and May. The foliage is dark green and very attractive. You notice it looks a little bit like elephant ear leaves. Now, this calla lily is Xantideschia ethiopica. There are a number of species and hybrids of calla lilies, and only this species really comes back for us year after year after year and is a reliable perennial. You may see other types of calla lilies. Here's a good example here. This one has white flowers, but they may be yellow, pink, or rosy red. But look at the leaves. They're strap-shaped. Notice the leaves of this species are heart-shaped. They have these ears on them. So get this species, Xantideschia ethiopica. This is the one that really comes back for year after year after year. Now, you want to put this plant in a well-prepared bed with lots of good organic matter like compost. Uh, they grow in the average garden soil very well with your other ornamental plants, but these also grow in the wet aquatic conditions. So you can plant these by ponds or right down into aquatic gardens, and they will thrive in that high moisture situation. Uh, the plants tend to go dormant in the summertime, so after they finish blooming around about April or May, you may see the foliage getting yellow and ugly as it gets hot. Don't be a afraid, don't worry, that's going dormant. Cut all that ugly foliage off, they'll come back in the fall, grow over the winter, and bloom again for you every spring. Add some calla lilies to your landscape. Look for them in your nurseries this spring. They're a wonderful addition. Forget it growing, I'm Dan Gill with the LSU Ag Center.